Jason, talk to me. Change the color. Yeah. So what do I do first? U times the x y by four. So we've got four x y is equal to so four x y minus two x is equal to six y. Next step. The Stationers Foundation sponsors the Stationers Crownwood Academy, a 1600 pupil secondary school in South East London, a member school of the Lee Academies Trust. The foundation's support is focused on the Trust's digital strategy. When I leave school, I would like to be a forensic psychologist. I want to be a software programmer because it's, it was something I wanted to do since I was young. Work in the technology industry and maybe do some work in the media industry as well. I want to do something in criminology, maybe detective or CSI. So the station of funding has been absolutely uh, invaluable to the academy um, for lots of our students kind of coming into the digital media centre and, and working on, on the equipment here has been something that they just never would have done before. They've never been exposed to this. Um, you know, lots of them sit behind their screens for hours every day, but they've never edited a photo or learned how to use a proper camera or done any filming. Um, and so it's been absolutely valuable. The thing that gives me the most satisfaction working in this academy is their constant need for developing teachers, whether it be for you to be a lead practitioner or to be just a, a normal trainer with, to increase your knowledge on SEN, anything like that. And also one of the largest and of recent, the most impactful thing that they've done is the implementation of their digital strategies. So they're incorporating technology into the classroom. So we've got the mini whiteboard and that's all kids have the laptops with the mini whiteboards on that. You could also, um, with the, whenever doing an assessment, it could be done online. So it's just the constant um, embedding of technology within the classroom. I really like it, especially the Promethean boards. I love the fact that I can put up an exam question, I can use the highlighter and the pen and model through an exam question rather than going to my whiteboard. Uh, one thing I like about the interactive whiteboards is that I find them helpful. I think when teachers do examples on the boards, I find it easier to understand. Um, I like that the interactive whiteboards are very good for like visual learners like myself because I find it most helpful when I can see what I'm trying to learn. I think the students gain, they've gained confidence. Confidence in coming to the board, confidence in modelling their answers. Um, as opposed to a traditional whiteboard where they'd have to have a marker and a pen, they're much more reluctant to do that. But with the whiteboard, the interactivity of it, they're excited. It's the excitement of it. They'll come up and they'll model their answers. So I'd say it's very confidence building, yes. Biggest benefits um, by far are the facilities that we have. I think we're incredibly lucky to have such a large site, but also to have such amazing facilities from our, you know, our gym and our sports equipment, but also obviously the digital media centre, which is absolutely fantastic.